Are you thinking of keeping hens or expanding your flock? Although chickens and other poultry species are officially classed as livestock, they can make great pets. Did you know chickens can recognize many different faces? They can problem solve, dream, and they can even blush and display emotions. They're also among the closest living relatives of dinosaurs. Are you looking for help with getting chickens for the first time or ways to make poultry keeping easier? Perhaps you'd like to reduce the risk of disease or control parasites and pests without having to spend a fortune. Keep watching for top tips from experienced poultry keepers and vets. Planning your chicken keeping setup. Allow as much space as you can for your birds as cramped conditions can cause them to get stressed and possibly injured. Two meters square of run space per bird is ideal, plus the ability to range beyond their run when possible. If outbreaks of notifiable poultry disease like avian influenza, bird flu, or Newcastle disease happen, the government may introduce housing measures which poultry keepers often refer to as flockdown. This means that you may have to keep poultry under cover for several months. Making preparations for this in summer is easier than in winter when housing measures are usually announced, often at short notice. Maintaining good health and preventing disease. Keep wild birds, rodents, pets and their poo away from your poultry housing, run, food, water and bedding. This reduces the risk of your birds being exposed to diseases or parasites such as bird flu. Removing food and water at night helps to deter rodents. Watch new birds closely for signs of illness and parasites. If you have an existing flock, try to keep new birds separate for 30 days. Regular use of disinfectant powder designed for poultry runs helps reduce microorganisms that can cause diseases such as bird flu. When bird flu is spreading, keep pets away from your poultry run. Using dedicated poultry shoes or disinfecting footwear helps to stop diseases and parasites being walked into poultry runs from outside. Remember to wash your hands well after handling your birds, their eggs and soiled bedding. A covered run is healthier and easier to maintain. Putting a cover over your pen will make poultry keeping more pleasant for you and your birds, especially in winter. It will also help to prevent your birds getting bird flu or other diseases spread by wild birds and their poo. A simple tarpaulin can be very effective. Good quality tarp with strong, closely spaced eyelets usually lasts longer and is less noisy in the wind. If you are confident with DIY skills, you might consider something more robust. Second-hand materials like conservatory roofing, box profile sheets and timber are often available on free cycle sites. Rainwater draining off your roof may be contaminated with wild bird poo, so you shouldn't let your birds drink it. Simple gutters can help direct rainwater away from your run. Ease of access for poultry keepers. If you are buying a new setup or expanding an existing one, think about getting a run you can stand up in. Your back will thank you and your birds will have a more usable space which will be important if housing measures are introduced. Some walk-in runs will let you connect a coop on the outside. This reduces the risk of walking disease or parasites into the run. Those confident with DIY might consider building a walk-in run. Second-hand materials like security fencing or weld mesh panels are often available cheaply. 
automating parts of your setup. Although it's important to check your birds regularly and carefully, automating some tasks can save you time. It can also reduce the risk of you walking diseases or parasites into your poultry run. Dripper drinking systems supplied with clean, fresh water from a header tank can reduce mess and wastage and are often more hygienic. Treadle feeders can reduce the need to top up feed daily and can protect food from wild birds, rats and their poo. A good quality automatic coop door will allow your birds to let themselves out in the morning. Registering your birds. All UK bird keepers must now officially register their birds regardless of the size of their flock. The only exceptions are non-poultry species that are kept inside homes or in fully enclosed structures with no access to the open air. Keepers in England and Wales can register using the gov.uk website and those in Scotland should use the Scottish Kept Bird Register. If you're in Northern Ireland, use the DERA Bird Register. This will help reduce the spread of diseases like bird flu or Newcastle disease and make it easier to lift disease control zones sooner. We hope you found these tips useful. Thanks for watching and enjoy looking after your poultry. Thank you.